The leaf-footed bug uh, does overwinter, and like uh, June says, yeah, it, it's a good idea to be aware that they just might be overwintering in your yard. Some of their uh, favorite uh, hiding places include wood piles, barns, palm fronds, citrus or juniper trees, or under peeling bark or in tree cracks. Yeah, so all those little nooks and crannies that we kind of ignore. And June is right on the money in terms of worrying about next year. Yeah, you want to look for them and uh, either squish them or put them in that bucket of soapy water. Right, or prepare your garden for the beneficials. Well, we they're beneficial to us that would harm the leaf-footed bug. Mm. So they have natural enemies, birds, as are spiders. And then there are some of the very small insects, like the small wasps, that uh, lay their eggs inside the eggs of the leaf-footed bugs. And when the wasp eggs hatch inside the leaf-footed bug egg, they eat the leaf-footed bug embryo. If you can invite the things that are going to uh, control the leaf-footed bugs for you into your garden, then you will have natural control. 